Hypochlorous is a non-toxic form of chlorine that acts as a much more powerful disinfectant than bleach. It is safe for direct contact with plant material and human skin. It can be used as a leave-on disinfectant and is organic approved by the FDA in the United States. Hypochlorous acid may sound like a complicated chemical solution, but it's actually very simple. It's made when electricity is passed through water and salt, using the process of electrolysis to create chlorine. Small amounts of vinegar are added to keep the pH neutral. If you're ready to switch over to hypochlorous, here are five things you need to know. First, hypochlorous is pH neutral, so it will not affect the pH of a hydroponic or aeroponic setup. It is important to produce hypochlorous within the pH range of 5 to 7, as that is where it is most effective. Additionally, the PPM, or the free available chlorine, needs to be very low when it reaches your plant's roots to avoid burning. It's also important to make sure you wait at least two hours before or after adding other hydroponic nutrients before you add your hypochlorous. Hypochlorous is a strong oxidizer and the chlorine will get used up when there are other organic materials in the water. If you're running hypochlorous continuously in your system, then you can just top up after adding your nutrients. This is also a reason why it's not a good idea to add hypochlorous to soil. Most of your chlorine efficacy will get used up trying to break down all of the organic matter in the soil. If you add beneficial bacteria to your hydroponic tank, hypochlorous acid should not also be added. It will focus on deactivating the bacteria, good or bad, so you're basically canceling out the benefits of the bacteria and the hypochlorous. Last but not least, hypochlorous acid can be slightly corrosive because of the salt content, so if you are using it regularly as a disinfectant on metal tools, we recommend rinsing them off every few times just to prevent a salt deposit from forming. Thanks for watching. If you're interested in learning more, check out our website or send us a message on WhatsApp, Instagram, or email.